What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name is Keith and in today's video, we're gonna be looking at how to create a LinkedIn account slash profile. So I've got the iPad here, I'm gonna be doing a screen recording as well, which should be on the screen coming up now. So we'll just go through the steps of showing you how to do this. So, so you need to go to linkedin.com. The way I'm gonna do it is using the website rather than the app, just so a lot of people can do it either on the computer or the device or anything like that. Same process is sort of the same on the app or the website. So at the top, you have an option called join now. So you click join now and it'll bring up this page here. So when it comes up with this, you've got an option to create with a particular email that you want and a password, or you can continue with Google. So that'll just sort of be linked to your Google account. So whenever you try to log into LinkedIn, you just use Google. But for this, we're gonna use an actual email and password. So I'm gonna start typing in. So LinkedIn at fuscomedia.co.uk. I've also used the Apple strong password generator to generate a password as well just so it's different from all of the other passwords that i use and it's always quite good to use that because it's sort of it's quite a strong password and if there does happen to be a data leak the password that's leaked from each website is completely different because it's using a new generated password each time so I highly recommend doing that and all you do is click on continue and when it comes up here it'll ask for your first name and last name so I'll fill that in but for this purpose i'm just gonna fill it in like so so this account is going to be one for the Finance for Fusco YouTube channel where I do all the videos and that because I do have a personal one but this is to show you how to create an account and then we'll use this account to do different business things so it's separate from my personal. So then all you do once you put that in click agree and join. Now this will come up and it'll probably ask you for a security verification. So as you can see it's come up with a puzzle so we're just going to solve this puzzle. Now it says pick the image that's the correct way up so very simple to do. Very very easy security check. Once that's done, like you said, it'll bring it up here. And this is, um, it's gonna ask you for your location where you are. So this is fills with England, but as I'm away with doing some work at the minute, this is completely different. So I'll just put in a new location. So all you have to do is, if it's the incorrect location, delete it out. If it's the correct one, then that's fine. So we'll go for County Durham. County Durham, England. Just like so, very generic thing. If you want, I can give a very specific one of your particular town. For the purpose of the video, we're just gonna do County Durham, just as a general location. And here, it'll ask you for your job title. So for this, I'm just gonna put a content creator. And it's actually got one there. It all depends on your occupation as well. So if you're a teacher or a manufacturer or whatever it is, put your job title in, it should be in there. Then obviously here it's got the uh, employment type, so you can just do self-employed. So for the company name, put in whatever company you work for. For this one, I'm just gonna put YouTube, see if it'll come up. And like so, there's the company YouTube. That's it, click continue, or if you're a student, click on that and do that way. Now what it'll do, it'll give you a code that's sent to your email, so it's very specific, so you can allow you to log in. So I'm just gonna check the emails and get that code. So once you put the code in, it takes you to the next one and it comes up here, are you looking for a job? So there's an option here for, if you're looking for a job, then you put yes, actively looking for a job. Not really, but won't consider it. Or no, I'm not interested in a job opportunity. All depends on what you want to do. If you're using LinkedIn to look for a job, then obviously select that. Further down the line, if you potentially want a job, then do not really, or if you're not bothered, click no. And then click next. So then it'll take you onto this screen here, which is connecting people. So if you know someone who's already on LinkedIn, you want to do a connection. So it's sort of like a Facebook, so it can be their friend. You can go on and connect with them. So these are sort of random people that comes up, or you can do a search and connect with them. Or if you scroll right down to the bottom, there's a skip for now or a next. So if you selected a few, then you can click next and it'll go through or just skip. So for this one, we're just going to skip for now. The next step, it takes you to load up a profile picture. So you can add one from Google, you can add a photo from your gallery, or you can skip. So for the purpose of this one, we're just gonna click add photo, and go to photo library, and it's gonna load the library. I've just got the one photo on here, and add this on. And then it gives you options to uh, do different things with your profile picture. So you can like crop it in, add some filters and stuff like that. I'm just gonna save the photo, just sort of save it as is. And as you can see, that's added my photo on there. And then you can also download the app as well, so you can do various things on the app. The future videos will probably have the app version of it when doing tutorials and things, but for the minute I don't need to download it, so I'll click next. And then again, it's got some options to follow companies and other things which you may want to follow. So there's a whole bunch of different things here. You can follow them or you can just sort of click next. But as we're doing a lot of different things on LinkedIn, there's no particular people that we're gonna follow for the minute, so I'm just gonna click finish. 
And there we go, that's our account created. So as you can see here on the screen, which is brought up, it's got our little profile here, Finance for Fusco. Now it's got a, a feed here, which will show various things. So as I said, my workplace is YouTube. It's going to bring up a lot of posts that are published by YouTube. And um, so if you work for a different thing like Caterpillar, Amazon, whatever, it'll bring up all posts from Amazon. And this is where all the posts from people you follow and companies that you follow will show up in your feed. So yeah, that was how to create a LinkedIn profile. Now we've created the profile, you can get on different things. But if you were struggling with how to create the profile, I hope that helped. If it did, please leave a comment below and remember to subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. And on the screen here will be a playlist for other LinkedIn things. So if you're struggling with that, then you can check those out. Until next time, see ya.